All right, talk about a creative way to get a message across. Art Bra, a benefit fashion show, features unique, one-of-a-kind bras that are designed by breast cancer survivors, their families, and their friends. Christine Willett is the president and founder of After the Storm, a group that helps cancer survivors heal physically and emotionally. Welcome back to the show. I have to say this is one of my favorite Connecticut style segments. Oh, I love when you bring these pretty bras with you. We love coming here, so I'm very happy to be back. Uh, Christine, tell me about what After the Storm is all about. After the Storm, what we do is we help hospitals fund their integrative medicine programs. So, for example, yoga, Reiki, massage, acupuncture, those services typically aren't covered by insurance. So what we do is we raise the money and then we give it to the hospitals with the, um, you know, the assumption that that's what it's going to be used for. Got it. Now, uh, this is quite a show. Tell me the details. Well, what we do is this year we had about 56 bras come in and we raffle half of them off and then we decide which ones get into the show. So we have have about 28 um, girl wearing bras and then we do have eight or nine man wearing bras. Man wearing bras. Oh yes, my <laughs> husband and his friends all get together. In fact, they have a meeting Friday night to plan out their little show okay. and this year's theme is Broadway. Oh, I'm sure it's going to be very entertaining. Now, are the models, do they create their, their bras? Some models have, and some people um, from all over the country have sent them in. I have one from Arizona this year, and I have another one from Washington State. So wow. anybody can design them and submit them in to us, and then we just decide which ones get into the show. Great. Now, tell me how the auction works. Um, everybody gets a bra paddle, and we have each bra goes off with a specific song that, that coordinates with it. And the girls just walk the runway, and as they're walking, we auction them off right then and there. I love that. Now, each of the bras have a name. We're looking at the ones that are being, uh, these are prizes? These are, will be picked, um, paired with a gift certificate they to will. be raffled off. Yes. And this one is called? That one is called Kiss Breast Cancer Goodbye, and that was designed by Dr. Michelle Solania and her staff in Middletown. Okay, and next to you on the other side? Um, this is called Carol Jean's Garden, and it was designed by C.J. Polanski in honor of her mother. All right, and we have two others up there on our mannequins. The, that, pink the pink one is called Flower Power, and that was designed by Stacey Marquesa um, in honor of her grandmother. And then the one with the fishing net, that one is called Reeling in Hope, and that was designed by oh. Lisa Uccaccini from American Cancer How Society. How right? All right, well, let's bring out the models because okay. this is very exciting. All right, here we have Jen. Jen is coming through. <laughs> and <laughs> She is wearing big blooms, and this was designed by Joanne Callahan. And what she noticed was that flowers always make everybody feel better. That's so true. the bigger the flower, the better people <laughs> feel. Um, and she also noticed too that when breast cancer survivors go through their treatment and everything, they really bloom and blossom um, afterwards. And that's where this inspiration came from. Thank you, Jen. That's very pretty. Up next, we have Claudia. Now, Claudia is a breast cancer survivor and she is wearing cocoon designed by Lorraine Yates. Lorraine is also a breast cancer survivor and Lorraine always felt, um, you know, wrapped up in the warmth and caring concern of her doctors and nurses and her family and friends and that's where this design came from. It's covered in butterflies, I love yep. it! Oh, even in the back there's a nice big pink flower. <laughs> oh, fantastic. Thank you, Claudia. Up next we have Susan. Susan is wearing proud as a peacock. Susan is also a breast cancer survivor. And this was designed by Sarah's supporters. And Sarah is a very young breast cancer survivor. She's now one of my really good friends. And they did, did this in honor of her. After her treatment and everything, she's decided to change careers and she's going to become an oncology nurse. Oh. And that's where this came from. So thank you, Susan. Now we have Shannon. Shannon is wearing Shoring Our Support, We Will See a Cure. I get it. This was designed by Marcella Krohn, and she did this really in honor of the people that are left behind after somebody has passed away and showing our support for them and the desire to see a cure for not just breast cancer, but all cancers. It's a pretty detail on there. I love the little danglies with the jewels, <laughs> and she's got, you know, wrapped around sea brace, seaweed bracelets on her. Ah. So it's really, really awesome. Very nice. Thank you, Shannon. Up next, we have Chrissy. And Chrissy oh, is wearing... Yes. Yeah, oh, it is, definitely. <laughs> this is on Angel's Wings, and this was designed by Annie Garland of Annie Garland Enterprises. 
and her inspiration was that we always feel like we have guardian angels or angels watching over us, especially through, you know, when you go through treatment and all this ordeal of cancer. And so that is where she had this inspiration. And those are real Victoria's Secret wings that Ooh. will be auctioned off with the bra. How fun. So if you want to come and bid on that bra, you also get the wings too. So everyone really should come and get a ticket because that's how you would get your hands on one Right, of these bras. that's how you get your hands. And the raffle bras too. Thank you, Chrissy. And now we have Linda, <laughs> AKA Wonder, Wonder Woman. Woman. <laughs> now, Linda designed this bra along with her friend. And Linda is a two time breast cancer survivor. And she just finished up treatment on July oh, 5th. She is a Wonder Woman. So she is Wonder Woman incarnate. And that is how she feels after you know her treatment and everything. She's survived this, she's gotten through this, and she proudly wears that cape. Oh, that's so. wonderful. Thank you, Linda. Can you give us a preview of some of the other bras? What, maybe some names of them? Oh, we have so many. There's a Fifty Shades of Grey. Oh, that would be interesting. That, that is a definite <laughs> one that you need to see. We have Candy Striper Gone Wild, ah. which we'll be handing out some candy to go with it. We have a Easter Bronnet. Cute. That is all Easter eggs all over it with an Easter egg hat. So no, they're definitely, they're one of a kind creations that you really need to be there yeah, to see. sounds like a great night. Let's put all the information up on the screen if you would like to uh, check out Art Bra Benefit After the Storm. It's happening Thursday, August 16th at the AquaTurf in Plantsville. You grew, you needed a bigger location, right? We did, we had to unfortunately leave the River House, but now we are at the AquaTurf. And tickets are only $40 and you get food and champagne, so it's definitely well worth the money. All right, and the website in case people need more information? It's afterthestorminc.org. Very good. Ladies, you look wonderful. Thank you so much for being here. All right.